heat a pan or kadai and add two cups of fresh grated coconut. You can grind the coconut to a coarse texture or you can also use desiccated coconut. Now saute the coconut on low heat till you get a nice aroma. We do not want the coconut to burn so the heat should be kept at low while sauteing. Do not wait for the color to change to light brown. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, go ahead and click on the subscribe button and also the bell icon so you don't miss out on any lip smacking recipes. Once you start getting the aroma, add 3 4th cup of sugar and mix it well with the coconut. Then add 1 4th cup of milk into it and stir the mixture well. You can use either raw milk or boiled milk. I've used raw milk. The milk helps the sugar to dissolve faster. We will continue stirring this mixture until the sugar dissolves. We can now turn up the heat to medium and switch back to low when necessary. Keep stirring it. After a while, add half a teaspoon of cardamom powder. You can also use the crushed cardamom. Mix all of this well. We will turn off the heat when 80% of the moisture has evaporated. Then transfer this to a greased plate. Use ghee to grease the tray. You can also use butter paper. Shape the mixture using a spoon or a spatula according to the shape of your tray. And then garnish it with chopped dry fruits. I've used almonds, you can use cashews and pistas as well. Now let this sit for 10 minutes, then draw lines and divide the barfi using a knife and your coconut barfi is ready to be served. You can wait for longer if you want it to become more hard. Enjoy!